the attic at Studio B. Comedy time. Two pepperoni, please. Thank you. Here we go.
good evening. Good evening. It's the end of day two. Um, we're tired. It's one o'clock in the morning. And we had a long day. A uh, very, very long day. So, uh, yeah. Um, with the rain, we couldn't do much with the rain. Correct. He couldn't do his zip line, unfortunately. No. They shut that down because of the weather. Um, we went to the aqua theater. We did. We went to the aqua theater, uh, but there was no seats. Yeah. Everyone was complaining on the um, line that they was having difficulty making reservations, um, despite the app indicating that there was say five open seats, 20 open seats, even some indicating 85 open seats, um, it wasn't allowing individuals to, to make reflect. reservations. Correct, that is correct. So um, people were upset about that. Oh, a lot of people were upset about so that. So there, was, uh, there weren't any seats, so basically we just stood around, you know, it's kind of hard to see. Like I was telling Lewis, from my perspective, I like shows and um, I like to be immersed with the shows. And well, when we were standing, it was hard to really enjoy it because we're standing, this crowd standing in front of you, people will move back and forth. It was just, but the show was actually excellent. It was a beautiful show. I've it never an excellent seen. Show. We're gonna show some footage, right? Yeah, we, we, I really enjoyed the show. But next time I wanna see it, and I wanna be sitting down, immersed with, uh, you know, with the cast and enjoy it a little bit further. We ended up going to uh, the party at the promenade. Mm, that is correct. Mm -hmm. That was pretty fun. That they were bringing fun. music from the 70s, the 80s, 80s and 90s. <laughs> our, um, our cruise director, Rick, he's just like, he's full of energy for him to uh, be able to uh, entertain all these passengers on this beast of a ship. Right, it's you indicated he actually reminded you of, of Lee Mason from Celebration. Right. So uh, yeah, he's just full of energy. God bless him. I don't know how he does it. He to entertain all these people. It's a hard feat, but he does it well. Then we ended up going to a comedy show. Mm -hmm. Comedy show was, eh. It was in the attic mm -hmm. on deck four next to the um, Studio B as well as the casino. Mm, you know, it's, it was comedy a, show was okay. <laughs> I mean, the, the main- It was a rated R. Yeah, the co main comedian was, um, he was, he was speaking very low. And we were sitting all the way in the back, so it was hard for us to really hear what he was saying. Uh, but, you know, we ended up walking out of there. It was all right. It was okay. I mean, he had a few little funny hits, but nothing. Right. Nothing you know. to jump for joy. <laughs> and then uh, after that, we ended up going to get a pizza. We had a pizza, and then from there, we ended up going to uh, the red party, which that was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. You indicated that it kind of reminded you of um, Virgin. Oh yeah, they are definitely. Now I'm not so sure. We've we've sailed Royal many times. Now I don't know if it's because we went to bed early or we just didn't partake in certain um, parties. Parties <laughs> but, after midnight. But the thing is, we have sailed on Anthem of the Seas twice. We've sailed on Freedom. We sailed on Navigator. We sailed on Adventure. Mm, correct. And, and I don't none recall. of those parties were on those ships. Exactly. So because this is a new ship and they're trying to make it a party weekend party ship but the red theme I'm, I'm trying to understand why would they take the if i don't know if it's true or not please comment in the section below if um you've sailed on world before and they've had a red party theme like um another cruise line yeah um i can say i have sailed on virgin voyages on scarlet lady and um they're they're trying to come for them they're trying to come for virgin because virgin's parties are just like that um except virgin is more uh the, the their party is an event for the whole ship so um they're very strict about age which is very important oh yes 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 they don't yes. allow anybody under 18 you have to scan your your sailing side card in order correct, to get in which is correct. a good thing yes because in norwegian they have a little bit of, of uh, Liberal policy where they let anybody in there, even parents with strollers and kids and at right. nightclubs. I remember that. Um, but they're very strict here. If you're not 18, you're not going to go into this party. But the party is very um, diverse. Yes, it is. Um, they turned uh, the Studio B ice rink into a, a dance club. The sound system. Um, we I'm heard better. We've heard a lot better. Yeah, the sound system is good. Right. I'm not saying it was bad, but it at Virgin. Yeah, but even on previous royal ships, we've heard better. Yeah, the system. Well, like again, this system is made for 
uh, people that ice skate in their music and their shows productions. So to make it into a nightclub, the sound system sounds a little bit different. Right. You know, because everything is in the ceiling. All the speakers are in the ceiling. I noticed that I was looking at the ceilings. And uh, yeah, so the sound kind of travels down when a bass is supposed to be down on the floor and make, you know, but anyway, that's just my opinion. But yeah, with that said, guys, uh, we're gonna say sorry we sound so you know tired and exhausted we are. We're gonna go to bed. Tomorrow we have another long day. Uh, we have plans to go away to, to our- Oh, well, we are going to the Mason Jar for brunch. Mason, Mason Jar. We'll let you know how that is. We'll bring that footage to you. All from right. there, I guess we'll just Hopefully take it as it comes. Line. Hopefully the zip line back is zipline. If the weather's good, then they, they'll do it. We already Correct. did the uh, Ultimate Abyss. We're not allowed to film there. We'll yes. explain to you why. Yes, 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 yes. Oh. Which well, sucks, but yeah. It's again, just... it's, it's one of those those things where uh, a couple of passengers mess it up for everyone. Correct. They were allowing people to film Even on GoPros. Even with the zipline at one point. Correct. You was allowed to film, but because you know passengers messed up, we asked them why, and we could totally understand. Right. Unfortunately, for those that mess it up for everyone else. So. Correct. Uh, but anyway, with that said, guys, uh, we want to wish everyone a pleasant good evening. Thank you so much for watching our channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Comment below. We enjoy your comments. And um, yeah, if, you, if, you, if you've been on the ship before, and what are your vibes on the ship? The vibe on the ship is amazing. I have to say yes, that. Yes, it is. The I vibe agree. of this is I not agree. like we yes. did last time. Yes. Everybody's nice. Everybody's having a good time. Yes. But yeah, well, with that said, have a good night. Stay blessed. And that's pretty much it. You got anything to add? Good night. All right, have a good night. We'll see you guys tomorrow.